The next feature we should look at is learning and tracking national events like national holidays. Well, Google Calendar can help you track and learn about national public events. And what you do to do this is you go to the line marked Other Calendar and click on the down, down arrow. And one of the settings you see there is Browse Interesting Calendars. Let's click on that. This view shows holidays from around the world. You can scroll down to the country you're interested in, click on it, preview it. I just previewed the Congo. And uh, click through the months and find the holidays that are coming in the month you're concerned about. You can also check on major sporting events. Let's click on that and see where that goes. I'll close that. And this page shows all the major sporting events. Um, you can click on any one of these, uh, which will take you to whatever you're interested in. I'm interested in the National Football League to see what's going on there. My team is the Giants, but I won't click on that. But if you do preview any of them, you'll see what major events are coming and you can plan accordingly, particularly if you're trying to promote a sporting event as part of your business. Have you ever wanted, wanted to track your favorite basketball team and see when it is scheduled to play? Let me show you how to do that. You click on other calendars and click on browse interesting calendars. And I've already shown you about these holidays around the world. Let's go to sports. And I want to choose basketball and in the National Basketball Association. And my team is the New York Knicks. There they are. What I want to do is to subscribe to their calendar and then go back to the original calendar. And lo and behold, there they are. And there is their schedule integrated with my schedule. So I can choose any one of the links here. Let's say of a, of a game that has already been played and I want to know what the outcome was. So I pick on this particular uh, game, the Knicks and Pistons, and click on more details. And lo and behold, I see the Knicks did not win. They lost 111 to 105. Well, I want to go back and go to a future schedule. And I see on the 19th where I have all the rest of my day already blocked. And I see the Nets and the Knicks are playing. I see the time and I'm gonna, I'm gonna get my family and we're gonna go to get tickets for this game. But this is how you can see a calendar integrated with your other calendars. A public event shows up on your regular calendar so that you can plan for it, plan around it, uh, promote it if that's your business.